So we also have clean Florida fill dirt, which can be used to raise up a berm area or even raise up any low area in your yard that you might have from flooding. We also have drain field sand, and that is great as a topper to pavers to help keep the joints together, or you can use it as a personal beach at your home. We have Brookstone gravel, which is a very close comparison to Mexican beach pebble, but a lower price point. It's got hints of gray, red, and even brown. Then we also have 250 sand, and it's the base to pavers. So it's what's used to help compact that area before installing the pavers. And what gives it the compaction is the sand and then minuscule shell pieces that help keep everything together. We also have riprap, which is used for erosion control, and it ranges in size from six to 12 inches, just to give a varying appearance. It can be used on the banks of a pond to help with erosion, or it can be used as edging around a landscape bed. Next, we have medium shell, which ranges anywhere in size from one to three inches, and it's great for driveways or parking lot applications because it doesn't break down as quickly as other shell. We also have road base, hence the name. It's used under asphalt and it's a mixture of large pieces of shell as well as sand. And it helps compact the surface before applying asphalt for roadways. Next, we have our white gravels. And this is our one to three inch white river rock gravel, which is a smooth gravel used in landscape applications for mulch or walkways. And it has predominantly white, but hints of brown as well. Next, we have our brown gravels. These range in size from one inch, half inch, and then one and a half inch. And like white river rock, this is also smooth. Brown river rock is predominantly brown and includes hints of white and other tones. Last but not least, we have our small shell which is a half inch crushed shell, great for landscapes in our Florida environment, as well as mulching and driveways.